I want to make changes in children's life, whether it's small or big. And I know that even if it's small, it still matters. Just my determination, it's instilled in me. I didn't want to be a statistic of not doing anything, and I wanted to make something of myself, and I didn't want this to hinder me. So at the heartbeat of vocational rehabilitation is career counseling and guidance. You hear the stories of the individuals who we serve, you realize that you're in the right place at the right time, doing the right thing for the right people. Growing up, I've always wanted to be a barber. I love the atmosphere in the barber shop. I opened it in 2014, and then a month later, I actually got injured. Doctors basically told me, yeah, you're gonna have to find a new career. I have never actually heard of any vocational rehabilitation services, but when I found out, I was actually happy to know that there is someone out there. Vocational rehabilitation has become much more creative, much more collaborative, um, much more employer focused. I've had people come up to me, they say, I, I don't know how you do it, you inspire me. I believe even if, even if you have a disability, you still have a purpose. The agency has provided a lot of support for myself just because financially my family couldn't afford hearing aids. If I was never part of the agency, I think I would have trouble here in general and not be the best teacher that I can be. The counselors really spend a lot of time trying to build a relationship. And I think once you have that relationship, that's when you have the trust. The counselor that I had for this agency was he knew what I needed. He was always there for me and he followed up to make sure that I was doing okay. He's really someone who is always dependable. They just want to keep helping as much as possible. It's important to keep teaching kids new things like disabilities and with an open mind that people are different and it's okay.